Well, this is the uh, Rumble Seat by Analog Alien, and um, I've been wanting to do a review on this pedal for a long time because, man, it is super cool. There are a lot of pedals out there that'll do uh, the same kind of a thing and probably let you do a lot more of it, but this has been thought out super, super well. So this one here is number 16 out of a 472 run. See here on the box. Um, it's basically a drive. It's their, their uh, rumble drive, which is used by people like Joe Walsh and Stevie Wonder. He uses it in his loop on his keyboard, and it's got a very sexy uh, analog delay, which is actually digital, but sounds absolutely um, analog and super nice. And a reverb, which was based on a whole lot of uh, twins they had lying around in deluxes, and they sort of chose their favorite sound. So um, I've got a Gretsch hot rod with, uh, what are they, the US made, oh, I can't remember them. Anyway, um, the other Brian sets of custom pickups on a Gretsch hot rod, of course, going through the rumble seat, and it's going through a Randall RM50, which I'm running the blackface module, so basically it's going to sound like a 40 watts, 50 watt Fender Deluxe, it's got 6L6s. Anyway, enough damn talking, here we go, let's have a crack with the reverb first. So, I'll take it down to a minor setting, so it's got a really nice... Okay, so I'm going to go on the rear pickup. It's got a really nice bounce to it, and you normally see the springs bouncing around. Let's take it up to halfway. It's almost got a, a return after it. I'm maxing the mic out there. I won't hit that quite so hard. Right up to a super wet signal. Okay, so that is uh, the reverb, so let's pop that back to a reasonable setting. Now the next thing is this fantastic delay, which is, whoopsie daisy, which is, let's just go with the setting we had on there. So back, both pickups on. down a little bit so it's fucking up So we can take the repeats right down and go for a bit more. It's supposed to be a rockabilly pedal, but I say screw that. Some nice delay settings there, but it really gets nice when you start mixing in with the old reverb like we had it set before. So let's get it up here and you can get some super spacey stuff happening up here. So um, let's move on to the old drive here. So drive's quite a different beast. Now we're just running right in the front and we're looking pretty clean. So 
straight up, rear pick up. So it sounds a bit farty because it is playing through a Gretsch. So uh, let's just wind up the game a little bit. So front pick up. Pump that up to halfway. Rear pick up again. So supposedly, as you get past 12 o'clock, you just get more and more harmonics. So let's take it up another step, rear pick up still. Mm. Uh, muck around with them a little bit together, so we'll take a bit of that out. Just with the verb first. really nice. It's chucking a bit of delay with it. quick demo of the rumble seat it's uh, expensive but man it's good the only thing that I could say that could improve this pedal would be if it had another small switch maybe on the side here 
or maybe something small here in the middle that could act as a boost even if it was just a clean boost and added to this it would just give you that extra channel um sort of a yeah a clean boost it wouldn't even have to have much in it just a bit more of a circuit that'd be great maybe stereo maybe 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 that would be cool um and pretty much i think this is an amazing pedal and um you gotta give it a go because it really is if you're after a wicked reverb and a delay it's great the drive isn't right up my alley but um you run it straight in the front of the amp like a marshall or whatever with a bit of gain on it and it crunches up real nice you get a really good distortion anyway thank you so much for watching uh please click subscribe and um we'll have some more videos coming soon so it's a rumble seat by analog alien good on you guys